everybody, this is Andre Borges and I'm here to commemorate the 10th anniversary of Inside Out, a sound art performance. And during this decade, I had many, many people coming to me with some questions. And today, we're going to start with what I believe is the main subject, which is how I managed to get the heart sound so nice and loud in the speakers and this is how I made one adaptation this is a hybrid I call it stethoscopic microphone and it's got a head of a stethoscope with a very large diaphragm you get the largest possible because it's a tiny sound then I attached it to a silicone pipe, you see. The other side of the pipe is a bit larger, so I could connect the head of a condenser microphone. You see, and here where the battery goes, it has to be a condenser mic, otherwise it's not strong enough to get the sound. Put the battery here. So here you can see some images from the process and you can see I got the silicone pipe from an oxygen mask and you see in the background on the table the condenser mic and the battery and uh, I was trying to enlarge the pipe so it could fit the mic so I decided to, to put it in hot water you see a drumstick there as well doing the job and uh, so I just had to make it bigger and bigger until it would fit. I tried a different model first, like not removing the head of the stethoscope. Instead, I would just connect the microphone to the end, to the part where we, we place in our ears, but it didn't work. So once you got this sorted, it's just the connection and then you connect the condenser mic one side to the desk and then the signal goes to the Arduino which is the theme for our next short video and the head I will tape to my skin and I will first try a few areas to see where it sounds better it's very noisy because it's super sensitive once you find it, you tape it very tight to your skin and you will have your heartbeat very loud in the speakers. That's it guys, see you next time, bye bye.